Okay, factoring by decomposition. This one is a little bit more complicated. Now, factoring by decomposition, because it actually says decomposition, I'm going to make sure we do decomposition. I personally don't care, as long as you can factor these. If you factor by trial and error, if you use the Australian method, I don't care. But it's saying do decomposition, so we will. What is decomposition? Well, in case those of you forget, here's the quick note. Decomposition is multiply A times C, split B, and then factor, factor, factor. Now there's a lot more to that, so if you want to look at a full note, you can probably go back actually on this web page, it should have a full note for that, uh, or on my class web page, depending on where you find this video. Um, so look up your note for decomposition, but this is the short step. You're going to multiply A times C, so 3 times 16 is going to go to negative 48. Then I'm going to split B, I need a factor pair that adds to 22 and multiplies to 48. So obviously not 1 and 48, uh, wait, oh, 2 and, so 1 and 48 is not going to work. 2 and 24 will work. So right there, there's my pair. So I need a negative 24 and a positive 2, and that'll go. So I multiply A times C as a little side note here, and then I find the factor pairs, well, as many as I need to, and then I split B. So 3x squared minus 24x plus 2x minus 16. That's my split B. Okay, next. Common factor. I'm going to take a 3x out of these ones, leaving with an x minus 8. I'm going to take a positive 2 out of these, leaving with an x minus 8. And that's factor 1. That's factor, factor, and now I factor out the binomial. So x minus 8 is coming out of both that and that, so it comes out front and leaves me with the 3x plus 2 inside. Done, that is factored. Okay, next one. So let's speed this up a little bit. Multiply A times C, you get 40. Find your factor pairs of 40 that get you to 14. Well, obviously four and 10 will get me to 14. They both have to be negative in this case because they've got to go to negative 14. So 5m squared, now we can put this in any order we want, but I'm gonna put the negative 10 with the five because it's easier to see those factoring. And I'm gonna put the negative four with the eight. So notice that these two things are negative 14m. So I'm just splitting it up so that I can do this factor. So that's my first step. Now I'm going to factor out of the first two. I'm taking a 5m, leaving me with m minus two. Now the next two, I've got to take out a here. So I'm gonna take a negative four because then it's gonna leave me with m minus two. So when I divide out of these things, if it starts with a negative, take out a negative. So here, that too, it started with a positive, so just take out a positive, but here the pair starts with a negative, so take out a negative. Uh, next, I'm gonna get m minus two and five m minus four. Done, so these two things get factored out of this thing. Okay, last one. Oh, get me a calculator. Uh, two, 12 times 15, I should be able to do this in my head, but I can't, so. I don't have a calculator handy, so I'm using my phone. 12 times 15 is equal to 180. Okay, so 180 and it's negative 180. Uh, negative 180 and goes to 11. Huh. Well, let's start looking for pairs. So I'm not gonna start at one and 180 or two and 90, because it's gotta be closer. Yeah, it's gotta be closer together than that. So let's try 180 divided by such things as 10. 10 and 18, not gonna work. Try 180 divided by nine. Nine and 20, that'll work. So nine and 20 are our pairs. Now how do I get to positive 11? So from nine and 20 I have to do positive 20 and negative nine. So I'm going to do, this equals 12x plus 20x, or 12x squared plus 20x minus 9x minus 15. Common factor out of the first two, I can take out, what, a two? Is that it? No, I can take out a four. I can take out a four x, that leaves you with three x plus five. And out of here, I take out, again, It's this pair starts with a negative, so I take out a negative three, and I get three x plus five, and then I take out three x plus five, and I get four x minus three. Done, okay, there's factor by decomposition.